Wake up, you lazy sir. What are you doing here, kid? I'm coming, John. On the job. I said you weren't coming. Yeah, well, Arthur says I am. And it's his party, boy, so come on, let's go. <laughs> Me and the big cheeses love it. Can't wait to slit some bastard's throat. You sure about this? No. <laughs> are we ready? Yeah. Train's due through tonight. All right, then. It's on. Charles? I'm ready. Gentlemen, let's go earn some money. Yep. Hey, all the horses untethered? I think so. Good. They should follow on behind us. You find a good spot, Wolfman? Yeah. Follow the trail southwest. There's a spot that's remote, but should still give them enough time to spot the oil wagon. Slow down. They see this block in the tracks, they'll stop soon enough. Apparently, picks up a new team of guards at the state line, so shouldn't be too much in the way of guns to deal with. See, this is what I mean. I disappear for a couple of weeks, and you cut me out of all the action. Just the action that requires a brain. Hey, slow it down. They're left here, towards Rhodes. Ha, ha, ha. You're a funny feller, John Marston. From what folks say, you had your feet up the whole time, playing sick and fondling that new scar like you're gonna buy a breakfast in the morning. Are you trying to kill those horses? You don't know what you're talking about. Stay close on this. Wouldn't want you getting scratched by a squirrel or something. Hey, slow down a bit. Now, I was saying, that could put you out of commission for the rest of the year. Why do you have to speak so much? It's incessant. Plus, I've still got some blood in me veins. You old bastards have forgotten how to live. Too fast, Arthur. I blame you two for rescuing them. Far too much trouble for what we got out of it. Here's good. Stop the wagon over the tracks. Yep. Remember, these are innocent folks. We handle... Mr. Marsh, Mr. Smith, Mr. McGuire, yeah. get over there. When she slows, order. And you? I'm gonna make sure she slows. I'll do or die with you. <laughs> I like it. Get moving. Need to get up there. Finish up here and join us on board. All right, get on that train. Hey, bastard! All yours, Captain. We'll go on ahead. Ah! Everybody, stay calm. And sure. Everybody ah. get shot. You're better go. than this. Everything you got, Please. money, valuable. Mister Defoya. There you go. Pay me what Let's you got, quick, mister. People, come you on. won't get her. We leave until this bag's full. Come on. I ain't got nothing. You want to have a little chat with Romeo and Juliet here? No, please. What's the problem here? Money. Valuable. Oh, don't do this. Don't help me. Just give it to him, Thomas, please. Okay. Come on. Okay. In the bag, God everything you got. Keep it coming. Don't be shy. People like don't you make me sick. These two seem to think Just we're playing God, games. I beg of you. God damn it. <laughs> sick is better than dead, lady. And Thank I need you. my goddamn patience. Let's just do what he says. Sick. So this can be. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Robert. Let's make this quick. You boys need me. 
No, you go ahead and look for the baggage car. Tough guy, huh? Well, Jack, you sure about that? I ain't wasting our time. You huh? show this son of a bitch we ain't Quick, come around on. here. Everything you got. Money, valuables. We ain't leaving until this bag's full. You won't get a damn cent from me. Let me hand you over to my friend then. Don't put it now! Son of a bitch. Come on, cuff it up, people. Don't be shy. Everything you got. Let's go. I can handle this from here. You should check on Sean. Okay. Okay. None of you. What is it? All right. Hell, hear me. For Christ's sake, you ain't even taking a look yet. There's probably something in here, Arthur. This time I'll look and you provide the cover. I'll try my best, brother, but I'm seeing double here. That gives you twice the chance of hitting someone. <laughs> Very funny. We'll take that. Head. At least you ain't got a hole in it. Are those tennis rackets in there? Harsh bastards. Just keep your eyes peeled. We deal with the best, all right. I know, that's what's worrying me. These folks are rich, all right. All right, we should probably be going now. Come on, we should get out of here. We're looking good in here. Some decent stuff. Arthur, we've got a problem. There's two arseholes on horses. How many you say? Oh, I just see a pair of them. All right, in that case, we're fighting. Horst Smith, get ready. You men come out the train now, do you hear? We said you men come out now. There's only two of you, you fools. We got a whole lot less to lose. Why don't the two of you ride away? That way neither you get killed. Goddamn liberties. <laughs> There's a few more of them torn enough. Man, my big mouth. Okay, let's deal with them. We won't tell you.
Ah, looks like we lost him. Whoa! Whoa! Ho -ho! <laughs> that was fun, boys. Real fun. We can see what they call you the professionals in the outfit. <laughs> Shut up. At least we made some money. Hey, what did I get? Gotta be a hundred dollars here. Very nice. You weren't even invited. <laughs> what now? <laughs> we still need a real big take. Enough for us to get out of here. Was that a setup? Law turned up real fast. I don't know. I don't think so, but I'm starting to get nervous. Think they followed us from Blackwater? Maybe. They found me already near Horseshoe, but I think this law was just locals. I hope so. I'm gonna head into Valentine, see if I can get something started there. Good idea. Either way, we should all go it alone right now. You know the deal. Don't be followed. Uh, of course not, boss. Yeah.